should have told me up front. You wanted me to... Shh, you're real quiet. Surprise him. Because he's right out... Shay, I don't see your brother Jonathan. Jonathan! <laughs> ah, I thought he could get away with it, did he? Oh, oh, Come here. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yes. Uh -oh. Tammy. Oh, oh, which reminds me, um... She's staying at the house for a while, too. It's no big deal, just for a great change of pace. Oh, great. We're a couple now. After my marriage to Sandy didn't happen, Jonathan and I realized that we're meant for each other. I know what you're thinking, and believe me, there are plenty of people in this town who are freaked out by this, but it's good. It's good. It's real. And isn't that what everyone wants deep down? I know we have a lot of obstacles to get past, but we will. Because we can do anything together. Josh can let you keep that on there. I wish I could say there was more good than bad this year, but, um, with your cousin Tammy... Okay, you know what? Um, you don't want me to do this. And Reva definitely does not want me to do this. Yes, she does. Okay, all right. Hang on. Hey. Ah! I don't know what's going on with this thing. Come here, sit down with me. Ugh. Just tell me what's going on. Well, you're trying to make this nice, happy video, and I'm, I'm not feeling either right now. You, you're doing great, Cassie, really. I got five, ten good seconds on that tape. I mean, I can, <laughs> I can use that. The magic of editing. Gee, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you edit it, then won't they wonder why I didn't mention Tammy? No, it, it doesn't matter. Oh, it doesn't matter if Mara and Shane think that I don't give a damn about my own daughter. No, that's not what they're going to think. Well, how can they not think that? Even Tammy thinks I don't care. <laughs> that's not true. She thinks you don't understand her. That's something entirely different. She knows that you care and that you love her. I hope so. I love Tammy with every ounce of my being. And every now and then I have to admit to myself that Reva feels exactly the same way about Jonathan. I love my daughter and I love my sister, but I don't know how to get through this mess. Reva, look, we need to forget the whole personal video shtick thing. We're gonna bring this camera, we're gonna go to the jail. The jail where I was, where I, your son, was. And we're gonna show him myself. I'm gonna introduce him to thug life. I'm gonna bring him around to all the places I almost burnt down. You think this is a joke, don't you? Oh, Reva, what's wrong? I'm trying to do something here! It's nothing personal. Chill out, Mom. I this was family just... is falling apart, in case you hadn't noticed. Jonathan, Cassie and I are barely speaking. Josh and I can't even sit next to each other on a couch and talk honestly to our own kids. Hey, you just let Tammy talk honestly. I thought that made you happy. Well, I should erase it. You don't mean that. I just want Mar and Shane to think that that there's something good that they can come back to in this town. Not just a bunch of problems and weirdness. Yeah, yeah, you don't want them thinking that their brother and their cousins are a bunch of twisted freaks. So, you know what, Tammy, we should redo our little chunk. Tell them we are together, but just, you know, in a book club. Here. Are you ashamed of us? I thought you were on our side. Not anymore. What would the good children think? I'm sorry. I do want the kids to know what's going on, but I just hate how painful this might be for them. Oh, Reva, I'm sure it'll be a great tape. You gonna interview my mom? I don't know yet. Well, if you do, could you tell her I... Tell her I said hi. Well, um, I should get going. Uh, 
You've got snow to finish shoveling. And FYI, I am going to leave in what you said on the tape. Gotcha. You think so? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Now, now! <laughs>